Birmingham prison has had a long and troubled history. It was the scene of a riot in 2016, which left four wings badly damaged. 500 offenders were moved out after the worst prison disturbances for decades. Since then, inspectors say conditions have deteriorated to the point of crisis. It's forced the government to take over the running of Birmingham from the private firm G4S. This is a fundamental failure of leadership and management. We'd hoped that G4S bringing in a new experienced governor would make a difference. It didn't, which is why we've had to make the difficult decision to step in ourselves. Prison inspectors said there was a lack of order and control at Birmingham, with violent inmates able to act with near impunity. Yeah, we need to get some people in here to terrorise them. Yeah. A letter to the Justice Secretary said there was a fear of violence among some prisoners who refused to come out of their cells. Groups of staff had locked themselves in their offices and conditions were found to be filthy with blood, vomit and rat droppings on the floor. The chief prison's inspector suggested ministers should have intervened earlier. If they already knew about it, why didn't they do something about it? Uh, intervene, take effective action, show leadership. Uh, it, it, it cannot be the case uh, that the only time urgent action is taken to restore decency in a prison is when an inspection report is published. Surely uh, somebody must have been asleep at the wheel. Since the start of the year, G4S has been warned numerous times that it must address the problems at Birmingham. Official improvement notices were sent to managers. Last month, a former prison officer told the BBC he was frightened to go to work. You would sit in the car for a length of time, trying to get yourself in the right state of mind to go in and do a day's work. Was it your day to be assaulted? You know, you were just expecting things to come along. In May, the voluntary body that carries out regular visits to Birmingham was so alarmed about conditions, it wrote to ministers calling for action. The headcount needs to be reduced. I think managers need to be allowed to manage and be visible on the wings. And I think the whole issue of safety and violence and drug ingress needs to be addressed. G4S won the contract to run Birmingham seven years ago, sparking staff protests. The company won't get the prison back for at least six months until it's safer and more stable. G4S said it welcomed the opportunity to work with the government to address what it said were the exceptional challenges at HMP Birmingham. Many other prisons in the public sector face similar problems of violence and drug taking, but none on this scale.